Good morning everyone. It is day 5 or day 4 of the bus After leaving Japan. Nagoya, and today we'll be stopping we are on at all stations train going arriving at Shin Osaka Terminal. Destination. Where is Cars the next one through destination? five are for passengers without seat I'm reservations. Right Smoking okay. is not allowed okay. on this train, okay. except in the designated smoking going. rooms located in do? Cars 3. No. have made it to our next train station. The next stop that we are going to is Hakun and we hope to see Mount Fuji today but it is absolutely chucking it down with rain so it's just our Unlikely. luck. Yeah, just our luck. Um, we've got a tour bus thing that we're doing. It takes about five hours roughly to get around so once we get to our hotel we literally have to we literally have to drop our bags off and then just head there because the buses stop at 5 o'clock and it's already 10.28 in the morning so once we get there we have to just go but we're hoping we may see Mount Fuji but like I said it is chucking it outside. I've got my windproof jacket with me one proofy and we're just sitting waiting for the train and it shouldn't shouldn't be that long now so I just hope we see it guys. Came all this way, I just hope we see it. We have made it we have made it to the land that smells like rotten eggs. Look at it. It's actually all of this all of this is a all volcanic rock. And the steam that's coming out of it, it smells just like rotten eggs. They actually, at the place up here, they actually do serve black, like boiled eggs. But we're up here on this map somewhere. Um, and you've got your hot springs and everything. And Mount Fuji, but we can't see Mount Fuji, so that kind of sucks, but it's literally just all like volcanic steam just around here. All volcanic steam. Just all volcanic steam. But it's really pretty though. No. Oh, let's focus on the rain. How do you not focus it on the rain? A drip in. Thank you for riding the Hakone ropeway today. This ropeway is bound for Togen Dan in eight minutes. My Fuji! My Fuji! It's supposed to be over there. Mount Fuji is meant to be there. Tell your vloggers that Mount Fuji, can you see it? Anyone that can spot Anyone it? Anyone can spot Mount Fuji? Let us know in the comments down below. Let us know because that is what we're seeing. Just fog. Lovely fog. No, it's fog. Fog cloud. Fog cloud. We'd love to go to a hot spa just yeah. now. Yeah, that's what the springs are for, but you've got to go naked. Uh, I don't so. fancy stripping today, folks. Oh, focus in. Take the one with the carpet and everything behind it, but you in it as well, Captain. No. Yeah. Ah. Just into the shore. Yeah. We all keep saying on this walk that we're going on that we really like these brollies that we bought because, literally, soon after we came out of the train station, <laughs> it was chucking it down. So we all had to buy umbrellas for like 500 yen, which is roughly a couple of pounds. I'm trying not to get my camera wet, but we just came off of the pirate 
ship. If I have some pictures, I'll put them up here somewhere. But we came off of that, and now we're just gonna go on a walk. It is quite cold and wet and a bit minging. My feet are a bit wet, so it's not good. Yeah, we're all, yeah, all of our feet are a bit wet and doshi, but we can't really check into our traditional Japanese hotel until three o'clock. Even though we arrived there, we were all soaking wet and they were like, mm -mm -mm, you can't come in. So we are like, hmm, okay. So we'll try to see Mount Fuji. Yeah, they let us dump the suitcases, which was great. But we're just at the minute trying to spare some time. We didn't try any of the black eggs because we're not all egg fans. But I did get a really cute like black egg keychain, so it can go with my other Gudetama, which I bought. Because Gudetama is bae. Um, so yeah. I keep, I keep, like every time I keep walking through these things, I keep imagining like I'm an anime because it reminds me like this village that we are in, it reminds me of the anime Shiki. Anybody know that? Anybody know that? It reminds me of it. Like, see this bit here? Does anybody remember it? Like how there was a house on the hill for the new people. It reminds me of Shiki. I don't know why. It just seems to remind me of the anime. So we're gonna go for this walk now and then we're gonna head back and get the bus back and then hopefully check into our hotel. But it, it would be a really good day if it wasn't chucking it down with rain. Any thoughts? Any thoughts? Any thoughts, anyone? Any thoughts on how the day is going? Wet, cold. Wet, cold and damp. That's how our day is going. If now taking me down this woody area here. It's very pretty, but because it's been chucking it with rain for the last two and a bit hours or something, it is muddy and my nice new sketchers are red. But it's all right. It's all right. Like I'll show you the path that we're on. This is the path that we are taking. And see, look, look at this mud. They're forcing me to walk in this mud. And my nice new shoes are gonna get wrecked. <laughs> but it's really pretty though. Like the trees are like so tall. Oh my God, I almost fell on a stone. <laughs> Oh, that's not fun. But the trees are like so tall here. And that's it that way. And that's the main road. And this is the three of us walking along here with our umbies. Our umbies. But it's pretty good apart from the rain. But apart from that, we're just a bit mad that we couldn't get a picture of Mount Fuji because that's literally why we came all the way along here. But we also said as well, like if we came back, we knew next time to just get the, to just get the the bullet train and then the train and not actually stay out here because we didn't really need to stay out here. But it's fine. We're all having fun. So it's all fine. And my camera's not because it's getting wet. Oh, look, rocks. Hmm. Two rocks setting on a path, setting on a path. There's two rocks. Oh, there's a strain. Hold on, I can't zoom on this camera. Ooh. There it is. Sagoi. No, it's okay. Oh my god, there's three rocks. Yes, that's a sign. It's a sign. Look, there is three rocks. That means it's a sign. It's a sign. There's a sign. It's a sign from dad. There's three. Oh no, the mud. <laughs> Look, can you see it? Look, there's a pirate ship too. Look, hold on, hold on. Look, Look. there's a pirate ship. Can you see it? 
Can you see it? That's the pirate ship and the shrine is over there. And that's the shrine is where we are heading to. But isn't it so pretty? Comment if it's pretty. I don't have any of interest. We made it to the shriny wine, so let's go and explore. It's always stairs in Japan. Shriny wine. Oh, I love these lights. Where are the lights? I love these. I love these lights. They're so cute. Just walking past and I'll take a picture of this unit. Look at this photographer. Perfect. <laughs> Look at this little thing. Beep. Look at it though. So pretty. <laughs> You're spinning your brolly. Oh, it's slippy. Mossy rock. Oh, I like that thing. I don't know what it is, but that's cute. Oh, it says if I can't read it. That's cute. Oh, maybe. Maybe they'll have them all lit. Is that like someone's house? Looks like someone's house. Is there? Gavrin! Oh. <laughs> that is like someone's house. I think. We made it up the 15 billion thousand stairs to the beautiful shrine that is in front of me here. All of these tickets behind me here, these are all of bad lucks. So if you get a bad luck, you just stick it up here. You just stick it up here and it's meant to give you good luck again. But can also, can we just look at the rain for a minute again? Do you see that? In the rain. <sighs> again. Always again raining. This is a shrine, isn't it beautiful? It reminds me of Shiki, I'm not going to lie, but so beautiful. So, here's what I was talking about your bad luck. You put your bad luck on here, and then you hopefully get good luck again. But this is a shrine, and inside of the shrine, it'll have lots of fortunes and good luck which you can buy and give you good luck in life and such and that's basically it that's the shrine also I just want to say this is the 15,000 stairs that I was talking about look at all the stairs do you see all the stairs down there that's all the stairs all the way down there is the stairs we have made it into our traditional Japanese house, apartment, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to take you on a tour of our room. So let's start with the door. This is the door. This is the wee little shoes that you have to wear if you want to go use the shower or the onsens here. And this is what you come in. You've got this nice unit thing. And then you've got your breakfast and teas and coffees which you can have here. You have your toilet. Now the bathrooms at this hotel are a bit different because they do not have a shower in the actual rooms. So you have to go down 
stairs to share with other people. So luckily I already had a shower last night so I'm not going to be having a shower um, in this hotel so that's fine. Bathrooms in here and then you just open the door. In here is like your dining room, bedroom and they'll set up the beds once dinner is being arranged but me and Catherine aren't having dinner because we're not really supposed to have gluten. We have a TV here, statue here, cupboard with, I don't know what's in that. Uh, then we have storage bit with a plug. We have a plug. And then, outside, um, cupboard, clothes, and then kitchen area set up with another TV and this is our outside of the hotel that we are staying at today. So they made us the beds for us to sleep in tonight and they look like this. There's a bug in the bed and a lot more head <laughs> That's our bed on the floor, there's another one behind there. That's our beds for the night. Can you stop taking pictures of me, please? Thank you. I get look at them. It's us now. Mum's had her Japanese food that the hotel gave her because I wouldn't have eaten it. I don't like fish. And my doctor said that I've got to try and keep on a good diet at the minute. So that's what I am doing at the minute. But But we're, but we're going to probably have an early night because we are going to another traditional Japanese hotel again tomorrow and hopefully we get to try the onsens there because they were trying to offer us here at this hotel to get it private obviously and, and it was like half five in the morning or like sometime at midnight and we were like no, so hopefully our next hotel has our own private one so we can, each of us can take turns going in it because obviously you have to be naked and we don't want to see each other like that so we're not going to do that. Gonna do that. Good morning, I forgot to end yesterday's vlog again because I am a bad vlogger so basically mum had a traditional Japanese dinner here at this hotel and she <laughs> didn't really eat it but we, we had we had food so me and Catherine were okay but um yeah so that's basically what happened and then we went to bed so that's basically what it uh, that's what we did so I'm gonna end this vlog here thanks so much for watching I don't even know what day it is day five or <laughs> I can't give up Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you again tomorrow for Rebecca in Japan. Bye!